Hi, my name is Eric Spangler. I'm Alan Fredericks. Sandy Hodges. Avis Pritchard. We're the cath lab team. I'm a nurse. Sandy's a rad tech. Al's a cardiovascular tech. <laughs> and I'm a nurse. <laughs> this is the procedure room part of the cath lab. And this is the um, x-ray equipment that we use. It's a G GE equipment, brand new equipment. Um, these are the monitors. We have the, um, the moving picture. We can also put that as a still picture. And then we have the hemodynamics. It's not lit up. And then our IVIS um, monitor there. Um, you're looking at coronary arteries. That's what we're looking at. We're looking for blockages. And uh, what we do is we shoot some contrast through a little tube called the catheter. And with that, we're able to see if there's any blockages in, inside the heart. Well, in the past, we've just done diagnostic um, cardiac cath where you are looking for blockages. But now, we have the ability to also fix those by using a stent or a balloon to open up a narrowing in the vessel. All the equipment is brand new. Um, new x-ray equipment, new monitors, new light, everything is new. The shell is the same, just the equipment inside is brand new. What we do is we uh, bring the patients in in the morning and we get them ready. We run EKGs, we start IVs, and we get them prepared to come back into the procedure room and have their cardiac cath. Then once the procedure has started, we work in a, uh, we, we kind of rotate positions, but there's a scrub position, a circulator, and a monitor position. Uh, everybody in the lab is trained in each position and we rotate per case. Generally, in order to come into the cath lab, from what I understand, um, my background is EMS and ICU. I believe Avis is also ICU. Um, so your background, you have to have a foundation in nursing or be trained uh, specifically for the cath lab role. Can you tell us a little bit, Avis, about what MedCath is? MedCath is a company that started out doing um, heart caths on trucks. And they would travel around and do heart caths on the in the call it a mobile cath lab and it has evolved into um, heart hospitals out west and um, fixed cath labs throughout the southeast um, there are quite a few in this area here and it's a cath lab just like here inside of a hospital but it's um, managed by and run by MedCath employees and even though we're MedCath employees we live here in the community we're always here at Grace Hospital when patients first come in, are they apprehensive about doing this? I, I mean, uh, it, it, is it a hard thing or a frightening thing for the patient? A lot of times they're very apprehensive. It's kind of the fear of the unknown because we do this every day. I mean, I've been doing this a long time. Sandy's been doing it a long time. So we, we're in our own routine. We know what to expect and what's going to happen. The patients who have never had it done before normally come in are very nervous and a little apprehensive. You hear almost 100% of the time it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I'm Hilda Woody. And Hilda, you just had a uh, cardiac cath. Tell us, was it as bad as you thought it was going to be? Uh, no, not near as bad as I thought it was going to be. They were just checking you out to make sure that what your arteries are okay? Exactly. Okay, okay. but you're feeling all right. I feel fine. You're less than an hour out, out of it, I guess, right? right. Okay. Were you asleep the whole time or were you? I was awake the whole time. And so uh, they, don't, they don't actually put you to sleep during that, do they? No. And Dr. Bracken was your doctor? Right, Dr. Bracken. And is Dr. Bracken a real good doctor? Oh, he's wonderful. He's, he's new to the area. But he's good. He's good. That's great to hear. Cardiovascular health in Burke County, should we feel good about it? That might be the best question to ask. Yes, you should be, feel very good about coming here to Grace. We have a very good cardiologist. Uh, we have a starting out a very good interventional program here where we're going to be able to do a lot of things that we weren't able to do that patients would have to go to either Charlotte or Hickory. Uh, now you can get that service here at Grace, so come on in.